Total Consecration to Jesus through Mary These are the dates for the total consecration. The dates when you can start and the day of consecration. Kindly pause the video and take a screenshot. Now, the procedure of the prayers is very simple. We will start with the purpose of the prayer where I just give you an outline of what we are going to do and what the purpose is so that you can listen. Just close your eyes and listen along. Next, we will have the appropriate readings which matches the purpose. After the readings, we will be saying the special prayers for the consecration to Jesus through Mary. All right, let us pray. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Purpose To obtain knowledge of the Blessed Virgin Acts of love, pious affection for the Blessed Virgin, imitation of her virtues, especially her profound humility, her lively faith, her blind obedience, her continual mental prayer, her mortification in all things, her surpassing purity, her ardent charity, her heroic patience, her angelic sweetness and her divine wisdom, their being. As Saint Louis de Montfort says, the ten principal virtues of the Blessed Virgin. We must unite ourselves to Jesus through Mary. This is the characteristic of our devotion. Therefore, Saint Louis de Montfort asks that we employ ourselves in acquiring a knowledge of the Blessed Virgin. Mary is our sovereign and our mediator our mother and our mistress. Let us then endeavour to know the effects of this royalty, of this meditation and of this maternity, as well as the grandeurs and prerogatives which are the foundation or consequences thereof. Our mother is also a perfect mould wherein we are to be moulded in order to make her intentions and dispositions ours. This we cannot achieve without studying the interior life of Mary, namely her virtues, her sentiments, her actions, her participation in the mysteries of Christ and her union with God. Reading True Devotion to the Blessed Virgin Mary by St. Louis de Montfort Number 106-110 Marks of Authentic Devotion to Our Lady True devotion to Our Lady is interior. That is to say, it comes from the spirit and the heart. It flows from the esteem we have of her, the high idea we have formed of her greatness, and the love which we have for her. It is tender, that is to say, full of confidence in her like a child's confidence in his loving mother. This confidence makes the soul have recourse to her in all its bodily or mental necessities with much simplicity, trust and tenderness. It implores the aid of its good mother at all times, in all places and about all things, in its doubts that it may be enlightened in its wanderings, that it may be brought into the right path in its temptations, that it may be supported in its weakness, that it may be strengthened in its falls, that it may be lifted up in its discouragements, that it may be cheered in its scruples, that they may be taken away in its crosses, toils and disappointments of life, that it may be consoled under them. In a world in all its evils of body and mind, the soul's ordinary refuge is in Mary. Without fearing to be importunate to her or to displease Jesus Christ. 
True devotion to Our Lady is holy. That is to say, it leads the soul to avoid sin and to imitate in the Blessed Virgin, particularly her profound humility, her lively faith, her continual prayer, her universal mortification, her divine purity, her ardent charity, her heroic patience, her angelic sweetness, and her divine wisdom. These are the ten principal virtues of the Most Holy Virgin. True devotion to Our Lady is constant. It confirms the soul in good and it does not let it easily abandon its spiritual exercises. It makes it courageous in opposing the world in its fashions and maxims, the flesh in its weariness and passions, and the devil in his temptations, so that a person truly devout to our Blessed Lady is neither changeable, irritable, scrupulous, nor timid. It is not that such a person does not fall or change sometimes in the sensible feeling of devotion or in the amount of devotion itself, but when he or she falls, he or she rises again by stretching out their hands to the Good Mother. If he or she loses the taste and relish of the devotion, he or she does not disturb themselves because of that. For the just and faithful client of Mary lives on the faith of Jesus and Mary and not on sentiments and sensibilities. Lastly, the true devotion to our Blessed Lady is disinterested, that is to say, it inspires the soul not to seek itself, but God only, and God in His Holy Mother. A true client of Mary does not serve that august queen from a spirit of interest, nor for its own good, whether temporal, corporal or spiritual, but exclusively because she merits to be served in God alone in her. Prayers Litany of the Holy Spirit Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Father, all-powerful, have mercy on us. Jesus, eternal Son of the Father, Redeemer of the world, save us. Spirit of the Father and the Son, boundless life of both, sanctify us. Holy Trinity, hear us. Holy Spirit, who proceeds from the Father and the Son, enter our hearts. Holy Spirit, who art equal to the Father and the Son, enter our hearts. Promise of God the Father, have mercy on us. Ray of heavenly light, have mercy on us. Author of all good, have mercy on us. Source of heavenly water, have mercy on us. Consuming fire, have mercy on us. Ardent charity, have mercy on us. Spiritual unction, have mercy on us. Spirit of love and truth, have mercy on us. Spirit of wisdom and understanding, have mercy on us. Spirit of counsel and fortitude, have mercy on us. Spirit of knowledge and piety, have mercy on us. Spirit of the fear of the Lord, have mercy on us. Spirit of grace and prayer, have mercy on us. Spirit of peace and meekness, have mercy on us. Spirit of modesty and innocence, have mercy on us. Holy Spirit the Comforter, have mercy on us. Holy Spirit the Sanctifier, have mercy on us. Holy Spirit who governs the Church, have mercy on us. Gift of God, the Most High, have mercy on us. 
Spirit who fills the universe, have mercy on us. Spirit of the adoption of the children of God, have mercy on us. Holy Spirit, inspire us with the horror of sin. Holy Spirit, come and renew the face of the earth. Holy Spirit, shed thy light into our souls. Holy Spirit, engrave thy law in our hearts. Holy Spirit, inflame us with the flame of thy love. Holy Spirit, open to us the treasures of thy graces. Holy Spirit, teach us to pray well. Holy Spirit, enlighten us with thy heavenly inspirations. Holy Spirit, lead us in the way of salvation. Holy Spirit, grant us the only necessary knowledge. Holy Spirit, inspire in us the practice of good. Holy Spirit, grant us the merits of all virtues. Holy Spirit, make us persevere in justice. Holy Spirit, be our everlasting reward. Lamb of God takes away the sins of the world. Send us thy Holy Spirit. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, pour down into our souls the gifts of the Holy Spirit. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, grant us the spirit of wisdom and piety. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of thy faithful and enkindle in them the fire of thy love. Let us pray. Grant, O merciful Father, that thy divine Spirit may enlighten, inflame, and purify us, that he may penetrate us with his heavenly dew and make us fruitful in good works. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, thy Son, who with thee in the unity of the same Spirit lives and reigns for ever and ever. Amen. Litany of the Blessed Virgin Mary Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, cheer us. Christ, graciously hear us. God, the Father of Heaven, have mercy on us. God the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God the Holy Ghost, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Mother of God, pray for us. Holy Virgin of Virgins, pray for us. Mother of Christ, pray for us. Mother of Divine Grace, pray for us. Mother Most Pure, pray for us. Mother Most Chaste, pray for us. Mother Inviolate, pray for us. Mother Undefiled, pray for us. Mother Most Amiable, pray for us. Mother Most Admirable, pray for us. Mother of Good Counsel, pray for us. Mother of our Creator, pray for us. Mother of our Saviour, pray for us. Mother of the Church, pray for us. Virgin Most Prudent, pray for us. Virgin Most Venerable, pray for us. Virgin Most Renowned, pray for us. Virgin Most Powerful, pray for us. Virgin Most Merciful, pray for us. Virgin Most Faithful, pray for us. Mirror of Justice, pray for us. Seat of Wisdom, pray for us. Cause of our Joy, pray for us. Vessel of Honor, Pray for us. 
Singular Vessel of Devotion, pray for us. Mystical Rose, pray for us. Tower of David, pray for us. Tower of Ivory, pray for us. House of Gold, pray for us. Ark of the Covenant, pray for us. Gate of Heaven, pray for us. Morning Star, pray for us. Health of the Sick, pray for us. Refuge of Sinners, pray for us. Comfort of the Afflicted, pray for us. Help of Christians, pray for us. Queen of Angels, pray for us. Queen of Patriarchs, pray for us. Queen of Prophets, pray for us. Queen of Apostles, pray for us. Queen of Martyrs, pray for us. Queen of Confessors, pray for us. Queen of Virgins, pray for us. Queen of all saints, pray for us. Queen conceived without original sin, pray for us. Queen assumed into heaven, pray for us. Queen of the most holy rosary, pray for us. Queen of peace, pray for us. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, Graciously hear us, O Lord, Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Grant us, we beseech Thee, O Lord, unto us, Thy servants, that we may rejoice in continual health of mind and body and by the glorious intercession of blessed mary ever virgin may be delivered from the present sadness and enter into the joy of thy eternal gladness through christ our lord amen The Ave Maris Stella. Let us pray. Hail, O star of the ocean, God's own mother blessed, ever sinless virgin, gate of heavenly rest, taking that sweet Ave from which Gabriel came, peace confirm within us, changing Eve's name. Break the sinner's fetters, make our blindness day. Chase all evils from us, for all blessings pray. Show thyself a mother. May the word divine, born for us, thy infant, hear our prayers through thine. Virgin, all excelling, Mildest of the mild, free from guilt, preserve us, meek and undefiled. Keep our life all spotless, make our way secure, till we find in Jesus joy forevermore. Praise to God the Father, honour to the Son in the Holy Spirit, be the glory one. Amen. As we all journey towards heaven, our eternal home, let us never forget that we are all God's children.